Hey everyone, and welcome to it. Welcome to our empty house tour. We are standing in our new home. Very loud and echoey because it's empty, obviously. Empty house tour. I really wanted to show you all the before of our house because we're making a ton of changes, painting so many things, doing a lot of projects. So you guys definitely need to see the before, bef before we do all the changes because I think it's gonna be a great transformation. There aren't really many like modern, newer homes in the area that we're searching to buy a home in, so we bought something that we could make changes to and make it our own. So that's the deal. We just bought a house. I have a video of the whole process and finding out that our offer accepted and everything in this video, so go watch that one if you haven't yet. So we're gonna be doing tons and tons and tons of videos of renovating and DIYing and decorating and organizing so make sure you subscribe to follow along those i'll be making a home playlist of like this whole process so you can always check that for new videos related to the house stuff <laughs> yeah so we actually had um both of our families over for dinner last night as our like first meal in our home so it's a little crazy and we do have some things in here like a bed that we slept in an air mattress last night so there are a few things it's not completely empty because we've actually started on painting. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get on into this. The cameraman here. The other, the, camera. the co owner. Give me the camera. Home co owner. <laughs> the like, you should be explaining this one. Here. Right. This is my office. Not much, not even close. Oh, but it will be. The pong table. Currently yes. being used as the desk. Oh, yes. Until my desk gets moved in. No chair. Obviously, I'm going to sit on the floor for now. Um, <laughs> Need some blinds to help with the glare, but other than that, we're looking solid. I'm keeping the blue walls, much yep. to Julia's chagrin. <laughs> the one room we're not painting is keeping we're not like touching it. it. I like dark blue, so yep. we're keeping these walls. Mm -hmm. Show them the closet. What know. are you even going to put in I here? I have no idea what I'm going to put in here. It's a big closet for my office. So yeah. My favorite red carpet. All the closets have this pedestal, and we're not really sure why, but it's all up on like a platform. And every closet. Maybe it's. Oh! So you can reach the top. Maybe, yeah, maybe it's so she could reach the top. Oh, maybe that would actually be great for me. So yeah, interesting little room here, his office. Yeah, you in there, follow. Bye, 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 bye. Oh. <laughs> He's like, I don't care. All right, well, yeah, so that's Keegan's office. Here is our guest bathroom. Um, it's a little interesting if you come on in. We have our fish tile and the wallpaper. So this will probably be a project eventually redoing this whole bathroom. It just depends on when and, and where in that priority list that is for us. But our favorite thing are the faucets. So all three bathrooms that we have have this type of faucet where it's motion sensored and you tap it to turn off or you tap it to turn on. And then if you want it to be warm, you just sit and watch down here. So now it's turning pink, pink, and now it's warming up really warm. And when it's fully like at its hottest, it'll be red. And it's like steaming, it's hurting my fingers, so <laughs> I'm taking it out. But you can see that it shows you, which is, now it's red. Very cool. And then you do the same thing if you want it to turn cold, you just turn it back and now it's going to be blue. Oh, it's ice cold already, that was fast. And just tap it off. Pretty cool. We did not know that until we just moved in and it was like written. The homeowners wrote a few notes for us everywhere and they're like, by the way, all the faucets in the bathrooms are touch and we're like, what? And then we just found out about the light changing. So it was really cool. All right, so here is the primary bedroom where we will have all of our stuff, bed, dressers, who knows, but everything that's like so big. We have two closets over here. I think we're gonna paint these doors or do something different here. But we do have some nice, pretty big closets, which is nice. And again, the little pedestal, but that's pretty good for a short girl like me. A lot of space over here. My dad just came and shampooed the carpets for us yesterday, so we know those are clean. We have a cool chandelier up here and a mounting for a TV, if we would like. And then we have our primary bathroom with this adorable door. We had no idea this was here. It's a cute little pocket door. I love this little glass. It's just so charming. Um, then we walk into the bathroom though. They like just remodeled this 
and we are obsessed. <laughs> so when you first walk in, there's a little touch pad right here and you can control and make it. You can night mode in here with different colors. You can Bluetooth your music, turn on the fan, lots of options. So we have the shower over here. Oh, Paulo. <laughs> it's awesome with like a waterfall thing, shower head. <laughs> really cool. Then over here, keep going, we have like our vanity, a touch faucet, and really cute lights. And then like this really pretty stained glass here as well. So, we love it. Obsessed with this bathroom. This was uh, definitely a big selling point for us with this house because it's just so cool and modern. We have a nice closet here in the hallway. Storage for who knows what, but it's a lot of storage. And here we have our living room. It's huge. So like I said, we're doing a lot of painting. So we're gonna be painting this whole entire room white. And we're gonna do a lot of it after we finish filming this video. So we're thinking a dining room table right here. Maybe a coffee bar over here. Fun fact, all of the doors have little doggy doors. And there's actually like an underground fence that goes around the whole property, which is really nice. We're not sure if we'll use it yet, but it is really cool that they have that. So exciting. Our backyard, beautiful island. And we are obsessed with the fridge. The appliances did come with the home, which is awesome because we obviously don't own any appliances, but we love the fridge. So my favorite thing is this shelf in this fridge. It can be a long shelf if you need more storage, or it could be a half shelf if you just had a pizza party for your whole family and have all these two liters of pop if you need to store those, because sometimes you don't always have enough space on the sides for like tall things like that. So I love it. And then it has this whole thing right here for water and ice, which I've never had a fridge like that, so I'm very excited. This little drawer, and then the freezer too, but it's so fun. We have a lot of cool cabinets, like this one has these pull-out drawers that are like the soft clothes. And I like that they pull out because sometimes I'm not, there's no way I'll ever be able to reach what's all the way up here, so I can pull it out easily and grab it, so very nice. I'm carrying over here for now, just until we get the coffee board built. Sink, um, more counter space. Should hopefully be able to fit our nugget ice maker over here. I don't really know. We got to figure out where we're gonna put everything. But uh, we don't have any of our furniture or appliances or anything because we wanted to be able to paint all the walls first before moving in all of our stuff. So moving day with all that stuff isn't going to be for like two more weeks. So we're surviving with what we have so far. But yeah, just tons and tons of storage. And then we have the oven and it's a gas stove, which I actually had a gas stove my sophomore year of college in our house. So I know how to use one. And then our dishwasher is over here. Nice. A lot of them are very outdated. I love this rack. <laughs> Feeling very spoiled with all these appliances. <laughs> Nook here where we might put our spices. I might like get the cute jars and label them if they're gonna be on display right here. And our microwave. And here we have something that I took for granted for so long, the laundry. <sighs> with motion sensor lights. <laughs> um, so at our apartment that we've been living in this past year, we did not have in-house laundry anywhere and we had like one machine down in the basement of our whole apartment complex but you had to pay to use it so we always took our laundry home so we would drive like an hour and just do it all over like a span of a day so now i'm so happy to finally have a laundry machine and a whole room so we have like our tide pods and stuff we're gonna be all organized up in here it's very exciting and then over here can either be pantry space or more laundry stuff um yeah very excited to have this whole area. <laughs> this is our guest bedroom. This is, what this is gonna be. The dogs love it, obviously. They're loving all this space because they were stuck in a tiny little apartment and now they have so many rooms to run in and a whole yard, so they play WrestleMania all the time. Here's the closet in the guest bedroom. I'll probably put a lot of my clothes over here because I have a lot of clothes. We have really cool shelving systems in here. Again, we'll probably paint these doors or get new ones. I don't know. Then in this bedroom, it's a guest bedroom because it has a whole like Murphy bed in here. So this pulls down and we will put a mattress on it and then it's a bed for guests to stay in. And then over here, just a bunch of storage. 
and more storage. <laughs> I think it'll be good to put like the pillows and the sheets and the blankets for the bedding and everything and maybe even our extra bedding in general. But yeah, really cool. The previous owners left us this awesome TV. So there's a big old TV here for our guests as well. Whenever they stay, they can enjoy it. And the carpet in here is really nice. We have our bracket for the living room because we're painting that wall right now, but <laughs> we have that down here. But yeah, really like this room. And then lastly, we have our garage. Hey! <laughs> so yeah, then we have a lot of land outside and some other things out there that I'm not gonna show just for privacy reasons, but very excited. The dogs love it, we love it. I'm excited to get this place painted and changed. We were thinking of maybe doing the backsplash as well, but just making it look more like our style. And once we get our furniture in here, it'll definitely feel more like home once we have all of our stuff here. And make sure you stay tuned for all the other videos we're about to start filming while we paint everything. So that'll be for sure coming in a video. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next one. Thanks for watching. Cool